I'm Fairy Luna, and I play games on the internet. If you're new here, thanks for stopping by. And if you've been here before, welcome back. Today, we're playing Sam and Max. This is one of my favorite games. Uh, right now, we're looking for a way to uh, exercise a demon. So we need to find some horsemen. Oh, there we go. You know where we haven't been? Bosco's Inconvenience. Nothing says inconvenience like a full body search before you can buy your candy cigarettes and all day suckers. You have been Ooh. deemed not unacceptable. Welcome. <laughs> Bosco, your disguise. It's 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 hideous. Claw my eyes out, Sam. I can't bear to look at it. It's just not Bosco. If I claw my own eyes out first, little buddy. It's definitely just I'm Bosco. Not wearing a disguise. Wow, I forgot how ugly you were without a wig or hat or something. My package! Why no disguise? What, no hilariously inadequate disguise this time? Sam, 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 you poor, naive fool. Don't you realize the time for disguises is past? No. Yeah, you poor, naive fool. Don't you realize that? Thanks, Wait, Max. Knuckle. A disguise could never protect you from T-H-E-M. Not T-H-E-M. You scared me. Who are those people? Who's them? That's exactly what I'm trying to figure out. I'm watching, I'm listening, and I will find T-H-E-M. Oh, no. Well, if you do, tell them. Okay, this is getting old fast. What's with your store? What's with your store? It is getting weird. I'm not weird. sure if you noticed, but this ain't a store no more, man. I haven't noticed anything. Look, I've got a hundred trillion dollars and a thousand faceless enemies. I don't need to sell anything. And why keep the place open? I'm a people person. Oh, okay. The store looks great. The store looks uh, interesting. It ain't a store no more. And did you know people who say that something looks interesting are more likely to be serial killers? More likely than who? Than non-serial killers. It's a fact, <laughs> a fact they don't want you to know. Who doesn't want me to know? Exactly. What's with your door scanner? What's with the fancy dance scanner, Bosco? Tools are necessary. Tools are the only things that separate us from the animal. Okay, that but... That probably plays a little better with the non-dog and rabbit ground. That's why I need the personal antipathy, registration annulment, and non-negational omnifunctional identification device. That's oh. just paranoid. Technically, yes it is. Oh, I get it, because it sounds like... Enough about the Enough store. about your store. It's not a... Oh, forget it. What's in the package? Say, Bosco, what's in hey the... Hey, guys, does my package sound like it's ticking to you? Not your best pickup line, Bosco. Oh, I, don't know. <laughs> I think my package is the bomb. Now that's a pickup line. Your package is the bomb. I would send you a bomb. My mother, of course. She sends me one every year around this time. Families need traditions. Why? To just get rid of it. I built that bomb disposal unit for that very purpose. So why don't you just get rid of it? Because it might be the billion dollar plunger I just ordered. What a dilemma. Oh. Just open your package, Bosco. But what if it's the bomb? I thought I heard ticket. Okay. See ya, Bosco. Oh, remember that green computer back in Santa's workshop? I think I know exactly what we're gonna do with it. Because we need Bosco to open that. Let's go back to the North Pole. Where to, Sam? To the North Pole. Off to the North Pole. Woo! Because I think I know exactly what we need to do. He said he heard chicken, right? We can send him a watch. From his mom. Surely it's fine. 
I think something's wrong with Santa's workshop, but we'll figure it out. We've got a man to exercise. want <laughs> we already dealt with the meme John we want this thing oh right I tried to click on the touch screen Obsessomatic stopwatch start kids panic ulcers early with a constant reminder that they're always running late you can hear the precious moments of your life passing with every second let's Neat. attach a gift tag who's it for it's for Bosco Bosco might like that Oh, I thought we had to also put who's it from, but okay, we figured it out. Happy elves make happy toys. You only see signs like that in environments where they're not. The second happiest place on Earth, as opposed to Disney, the happiest where place to, on Earth. Sam? Back home. Let's head back to civilization, or what's left of it. Well, I mean, after that stuff with Brady Culture and the giant Lincoln rampaging and the Dakota Wars. Oh, no, wrong way. I'm just so used to, if I see Sybils, I go the other way, you know? For Bosco's. Howdy, Bosco. I just got a package, and this one's ticking louder than all five of Larry King's pacemakers put together. Oh, no. It's gotta be my mama's bomb. I'm gonna blow it to kingdom come. Now, while he's distracted, Max, grab the package and let's get it. Look, Sam! It's the supersized famine figure! With realistic binging and purging action, it's got over 1,700 points of articulation. 250 in the jowls alone! You never Amazing! Good at waiting to open presents, little buddy. Wait! Where's my package? Dear God! They took it! And they took Sam and Max, too! We're fine. No place safe. I love how it shows on the screen behind him. Like, he, he clearly x rayed it. Alright, where else have we not been? We've been to Bosco's. We've been to Trivia. Um, let's take a look around and see. What else have we got around here? Jimmy Two Teeth? No, that's just a regular skin body. Never mind. What else have we got around? A garage. Pimp the car. I remember that. There used to be a TV show where. Uh... What's this? A clandestine meeting of the Computer Obsolescence Prevention Society? The cops are obsolete no longer. Welcome to the grand opening of Pimp the Car. Hey, that's a horseman. We offer sick car upgrades to a very exclusive clientele. How exclusive? No one. Get it. This is an auto body shop? What was here before you opened this body shop? A string of unsuccessful body shops. That tracks. That was just terminated! What makes you think you will have better luck? A recent influx of road debris will result in the projected 6-4% increase in revenue. Me! Road debris? From the main tron? Aww. A shipping mishap from the North Pole has resulted in a glut of unwanted torture me Elmer doll. Destroy them all! Okay. Don't you like torture me Elmer? What have you got against torture me Elmer? Show off! My associates were once the most popular toys available. 
but no more. Oh. Beating up a doll cannot compare with the wonder and the excitement of arithmetic and grammar. <laughs> he's, he's right. Been educational toys. I knew there was a reason I didn't like them. Oh. Well, Buster Bl Bluster Blaster definitely wouldn't have been. Aw, oh, poor guy. Well, can you decorate our car? We'd like to pimp our car. Please make a selection from the following menu. Okay. If you'd like the exclusive Death Horseman hood ornament, press 1 now. Okay. And what else? That is all we have. There was an ordering malfunction. Aww. Oh, my fault. Actually, we also offer a wide range of completely worthless decorative decals. I love worthless decorative decals. Oh, we want some worthless decals. What's this about decorative decals? We can outfit your ride with a wide assortment of decorative embellishments created by our in-house auto detailing artists. <laughs> Is that Chippy? It's Chippy! His mother was the label maker. Oh. We the streets and obliterate rare objects. If we deem them suitably interesting, we will reward you with a decal to commemorate the joy of destruction. I well, love the joys nice. of destruction! What should we be obliterating? That is for you to determine. Hooray! We want that horseman. We'll take that death horseman hood on. Excellent! First, however, you must complete the Pimpler Car Driving Challenge. Oh give us the horse. Where is the fun in that? We've pulled together our years of experience in designing the most advanced computer games to bring you <laughs> the ultimate augmented reality driving experience. Okay. Reality. Yes. While you weren't looking, we placed a pair of our patented augmented reality goggles in your vehicle. You did? <laughs> Nice work, Chippy! Reality, your driving experience will be five to ten times more satisfying than ever before. And probably more dangerous, would too. Would you like to try the driving challenge now? Yes! Let's go! And how? Eat my dust. Initiating augmented reality driving sequence. Do, 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 do. Oh, I took it a second. Okay. Hello! And welcome to the Pimp Le Car Driving Challenge. Thanks to advances in nanotechnology and the dark arts, you can now drive using a computer keyboard in addition to your mouse. Oh, I'm really excited. Your mission is to hit the display number of torture me Elmer dolls. Okay. And you must do it in the allotted time. Okay. Let's go already. Ready? Go! You can drive with the keyboard. Thank you. Look, Max, it's the sudden unexpected death figurine with super reaping action. Now, wherever we drive, pedestrians will feel the icy chill of death. They would anyway. More so than usual. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Whee! Let's grab that horseman. Okay, oh, where else have we hole. been? There's one more horseman, right? I mean... Isn't there? There's gotta be. Um... 
Yeah, we've only got three. Well, let's see if we can talk to Jimmy. That's not Jimmy at all. That's just a skin body. Is Jimmy around here somewhere? Jimmy Two Teeth! There he is! He's got big boxing glove. What do you want, buddy? Hey, my missing boxing glove! That's my lucky glove, hut! Jimmy oh. Two Teeth, what are you and your unsavory pals doing in the burned out husk of this robot? The first rule is we don't talk about what goes on in the burned out husk of this robot. Okay. Hey, neat horse. Give it to me. Nothing do it. That's my championship trophy, and I want it fair and square. I always thought being shipless and lazy was its own reward. They're giving out trophies now? Oh, oh no. Championship wise guy. See ya, suckers. Hey. Let us get a hold of that horse, Jimmy. I don't deal in that stuff anymore. Oh, you mean my butt? Oh! Nothing doing. You want to see my trophy? You've got to come in here and win it from Where me. a little big for that. in there, much less into the ring. Hey, I don't make the rules, buddy. I just exploited it. Jimmy. Good gravy. Well, if it's a boxing championship, then it's a boxing doll we put. In you go, baby. Nobody put babies in a corner. In this corner, zero victory, 48 defeats, and one draw to the unsportsmanlike. <laughs> a carving knife. Again, at 14 ounces. Ah, it's not too bad for a rat. I love those low res rats in the back. Coming direct from the North Pole, weighing in at one pound, 14 ounces without batteries. Boxing! Boo all you want. Move your mouse left and right to dodge and click either mouse button to punch or use the keyboard. Use the left and right arrow keys to dodge or A and D keys. And use the A or D keys to punch. Okay, we're definitely using the keyboard for this. Ready, fight! Money blow! Left hand to her! Okay. Come on. Oh, I meant to dodge. I meant to dodge the other way. Okay, I get it. Where are you pulling back from? I don't play punch out good. Okay, I got it. Oh dear. And he's out okay. Okay. I got it. I, I got it. I got it. What's this? A new opponent hailing from a potential chip bag in the dumpster outside the slot Amazing. He is a skin buddy. Okay. Ready, fight. I hate punch out. Okay, he wants me to dodge the other way. Yeah, to dodge in the direction of the punch. Ah. Uh. Come on. Right 
Okay. Put him away. Okay. We're getting it. Is he gonna are you gonna buddy, are you gonna Oh darn it. <laughs> well, I'm glad it's down to the wire, but I, I don't mean for it to be. I just thought Left hook it connects. Okay. Knockout. Foxy Betty loses. Oh. Like to try again. Yes. Bring it on. Ready. Fight! Right hook! Right hook! Okay. Right hook! Right hook! Left hook! Okay. I missed which one I was supposed to hit, apparently. Okay. Come on. I got nine brains and none of them working. Right hook, put him away. We can do this. Super exclusive war action figure with extra. Hmm, there are pieces missing. I don't see the weapons of mass destruction. Eh, who needs them? How could I lose? I'm no expert, Jimmy, but I bet being a loser helped. You, you're right. I, I can't go on like this. Goodbye, cruel world. Oh, nice going, Max. Now see what you've done? Jimmy's gonna off himself. Huh. I always thought guys appreciated a bracing, candid reality check. Oh. Suicide causation rate suggests otherwise. Oh. I'm gonna do it. I'll jump, I tell you. Hang on a second, Jimmy. Jimmy, this isn't like you. What do you mean? You're not the suicidal type. You don't have the guts <laughs> or the follow through. Oh, no. no. Things will turn up. It's always darkest before the dawn, Jimmy. What the hell does that even mean? Give it up, Sam. Oh, you're right. If somebody as dim as you can tell I'm just phoning it in, why bother? Oh, no. After you jump, can I have your stuff? Like what? I ain't got nothing. Don't say that. Your pelt looks like it'd make a great pair of ear warmers. Oh. Wouldn't you rather die by my hand? I guess it'd be faster and better to get taken out by a friend. You are my friend, right, Max? Yeah! Hmm, I wonder what I could use to do the job. The Luger? A nine iron? You're not even listening to me, are you? Of course I am, Sam. Go on! Hey, when you jump, try to hit somebody <laughs> annoying on the way down. Oh. Like all those soda poppers. Which one's the incontinent one again? I couldn't tell you. Boy, you really are useless, aren't you? Wow! You know, your wife's gonna give you hell if you kill yourself. Mary? She left me! You're overreacting, Jimmy. You think? Uh. Sure. Your wife probably never really loved you in the first place. Wow! Look on the bright side. 
No wife, no family, no job. What right side? Well, with all the brain damage you got from boxing, you'd make a great vacant eye janitor. Okay. And <laughs> nuts. My boxing career didn't even last long enough to give me a decent case of brain damage. Aww. Aww. Turn that frown upside down. That nonsense ain't helping. Sorry, Jimmy. It's just that suicide is too horrible for me to even contemplate. Even though we'd all be happier if you were dead. That's no glitch. Well, I guess we've kind Max, of exhausted. I don't think this is helping. I disagree, Sam. I feel much better about myself already. Boys. Well, we'll get him down sooner or later. Or maybe we'll it's a wonderful life this. Legit, I can't actually remember how this works. Where to, Sam? To the North Pole. Off to the North Pole. And we've got a fun little decal on our car, marking that we put, uh... Okay, we should be able to perform that exorcism now. I just don't remember what we were doing. Oh wait, we needed a magnetic something. What did we need? Well, we needed a strong magnetic center to... Wait, do I have the instructions? To exorcise the demon, it says we'll need to collect the four horsemen of the apocalypse action okay, figures. Okay, got that. Place the horsemen around a magnetic pole. We got and that. Draw the demon out using the friendly demon song. Okay. Can we start the exorcism now? No. no we still need three more horsemen. I have to hurry. Go. I've got a sudden, inexplicable craving for pea soup. Oh, gross, Max. Was that the pestilence one? It definitely was. I hope this demon appreciates all the work we're going through. Yeah. I just hope he doesn't rip our lungs out and eat them in front of us. That That's would be a little awkward. I mean. Have fun, Max. I can't wait till we finally exercise this bastard and put the oh. video up on oh. YouTube. Max. You. We still need one more horseman. <laughs> we are putting the video up on YouTube, buddy. I'm doing it. That's In fact, one. it might even now already be up now. We have to. If we want to save Santa the season of giving and possibly the entire Earth as we know it, yes. Still hardly seems worth it. Max. Let's go. Let's put on the friendly demon song. Like gelatinous goo. He was the most unholy creature that was, was ever born. born. In lower Manitoba. In lower Manitoba. Even the other demons scared to let him join the games. The games. The games. The games. Like Minesweeper. And if you want to meet him, you just have to shout his name. Hey, shambling corporate presence. Did I do it right? It worked. The power of Christmas compels you. Any second now, <laughs> Santa's gonna walk out that door demon free and shower us with gifts like absentee dad and guilty conscience. Did it work? <laughs> Wait. Oh, it was. You mean? But I, I, I thought. But I thought. What? No. Wait, quick! Not gonna be a dead. 
Feliz Navidad, baby. Sand, I knew one of them was possessed. Nothing? Didn't you guys read the back of the instructions? There's a back? Very important. Make sure you have the spirits of Christmas to contain the beast, or you're screwed. Sam and Max, it's up to you to save Christmas! Yep, we're screwed. Oh no, we're saving the holiday? Oh, Alright. I guess Santa was actually onto something. Well, I guess we can go in a safe now that he's not standing on it. Oh, the spirits of Christmas. Who dares to disturb our... Oh, it's you. You know us? We know all those who have ever ruined Christmas. Especially the repeat offenders. I've never oh, ruined Christmas. Dig the spirit of Christmas patterns, brothers. I am the spirit of Christmas present. Okay. And that cat's the spirit of Christmas yet to come. Be shy. What's your 20, good buddy? We could use some help saving Oh my Christmas. gosh. We're not bad people. We've just had bad luck with major holidays. And automobiles. And federal statutes. It is your own selfish actions that have brought this to pass. So should we go look selfish? in the past? We're freelance police. We save the world. Sometimes on purpose. You got no clue the bad karma you've built up, man. You will need the combined help of all three of us to defeat the demon. Okay. We will show you three Christmases you've ruined. Set them right, and we will consent to help you. Okay. Where are you going? I have to get some air. That safe reeks of weed and dilithium crystals. <laughs> well, he is the 70s. Okay. Anything else in here that I care about? Well, out we go. I suppose we didn't have to go that way, but it is more fun. Oh. Portal to the future. Is there a portal elsewhere? Oh yeah, there is. Portal to the present, I assume, and portal to the past. All right, sensible thing to do is go past first. You cats ready to take a freaky trip to the past? You bet. I want to rub my body all over Mary Curie. And see if you'll glow in the dark? That'd be neat, too. What, man? We ain't going back that far. Jump in. Oh. Me. Here we are in your office in the not too distant past. This was Christmas. I remember this. This is when we had to retrieve the Toy Mafia's meatball sandwich that Leonard tried to fence to Jimmy. Do we get to beat up Leonard some more? No way, Max. These cats can't sense your presence in any way, dig? Okay. You are here to right a terrible wrong you once committed. We are? have to stop ourselves from doing yo mama jokes? Just watch. See you around, sucker. Wait, aren't you gonna untie me? Hello? Guys? Jimmy? Anybody? Well, Jimmy, where's this big store that's gonna change everything? Where's all the money that's gonna save our dear tiny Timmy? Yes, Daddy. Where the f*** is it? Whoa! It's hopeless. The doctors say his Tourette's syndrome will kill him if they don't operate soon. Don't cry, Mommy. I'll get the f*** with the f*** the f*** angels. It's all a bust, Mary. Every time I try to make an honest living, Sam and Max smack me down. Oh, oh sh Jimmy, we were all counting on you. I know, Mary, I know. Oh, if baby. If only I'd have stuck to boxing, I could have been somebody. Instead of being a rat, which is what I am. So get your Aww. little boxing glove and go fight. I, I don't have it no more. Sam and Max took it. Again with Sam and Max. If you spend more time boxing and less time sitting around watching TV, you'd be champ. Face it, Jimmy. You're a washout. 
No! Don't fight mommy and daddy. Daddy's my hero, and he'll make everything right again. Aww. You'll see, you f***ing You'll see, you'll f Wow! I'm glad it did the censoring for me. Oh, you f***ing Oh, you'll see, you'll see, f***ing All right, all right, settle oh down, little God. guy. I'll go call the doctor to ease his suffering. Just get that glove, Jimmy. Our baby doesn't have much time to live. And so, Sam and Max, you see what you gotta do. Eat up Leonard some more? Uh. No. Well, we'll figure out what we might have to do Jimmy, later. Stop sitting uh, out and get that glove. Next time, in fact. That's it for today, everybody. I'll see you all next week with more Sam and Max. Or you can come visit me tomorrow when I'll be playing Monster Sanctuary. Or you can come visit me later tonight when, hypothetically, I'll be streaming. Uh, however you choose to come visit me, make sure you stop by and say hi. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share so that you can see more of this and so that other people can see it too. And I will see you all next time. Thanks for playing along with me, everybody.